Five, four, three, two, 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 one, 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 one. And you now tune into the greatest podcast in the world. Sorry to disappoint. <laughs> I go by the name of Marcos Alexander. <laughs> Behind cameras, we got the bartender. <laughs> to my right side, big gangsta, Chris. Yeah. And to my left side, he goes by the name of Mr. Blue Label himself. Mm. My boy, J A I Hi, Hi, me. And I got money, hoes, money in her. Thank you for always watching the video. Like this video if you made it this far. That's all I'm going to say. Subscribe to the channel if you made it this far. If you're listening to this through audio, we in every platform. Yes, sir. Google Play, Amazon Music, Apple Podcast, Spotify. Yes, sir. If you want to listen to this through audio, we in every problem. Yes, sir. Once again. And subscribe to the channel if you made it this far. And remember, every Friday, 8.30 p.m., every Friday, we live on YouTube at 8.30 p.m. every Friday. Uh -huh. We do challenges. We do a mini podcast. We argue. We do drinks. We smoke hookah. We talk. We argue. We get drunk. You Check, Come, you kicking it with the fellas. <clears throat> Join us on Friday, every Friday, 8.30 p.m. <clears throat> on YouTube. We already made four lives. They're already in the YouTube channel. And you will see all the crazy shit we do on Fridays. That's the day that we chill. And I want to say something, though. The quality is getting better per every live. Yeah, because... So keep commenting. If you see something that is wrong, comment it. We're trying to fix it. We found so many issues already we got fixed. So next live is going to be crazy. So. We're learning as we go. It's Facts. a live show. It's not like a podcast. See, and we don't have a millionaire team behind us, right? Yeah, you know yeah, what yeah. I mean? It's us doing it. We're doing it ourselves. It's Facts. not a podcast. Because the podcast, we got it down packed already. You don't see no mistakes on the podcast. You hear us good. You see us good, right? But... On Fridays, bear with us because it's something we're trying new and we getting perfect at it little by little. So bear with us. I expect you to see you there every Friday, 8.30 p.m., YouTube Live, S2D Live. That's the name of it. But, yo, what's popping? How y'all feeling today? How y'all feeling? Who knows? Maybe this Friday, if it's good, we might do a S2D barbecue. Oh. Ooh, it depends on the weather, right? You can yeah. see the churrasco it live. The churrasco churrasco live, baby. But, yo, what's popping? How y'all feeling? How y'all feeling? Yo, we good. Y'all good? good? How was y'all week? How was y'all week? I'm my next, bro. Bro, bro, bro got injured. Yeah, yeah, LeBron got, got injured, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so New York, New York stand up real yeah, quick. Yeah, New, New York, York right stand now, up. We, even though we won the game, but still. Still, yeah, right. we, we cooked them, though. Yeah, we cooked them, yeah. Um, how was y'all weekend, though? I actually had like three times already. Um, my weekend was pretty boring. Yeah? You know? uh, yeah, I literally stayed home because this is my first weekend off in a long time. Okay. Just like chill. Me, me and oh, Shorty. so you stopped working the suit for the weekend for the first time? Yeah, me and, me and Shorty just chilled at the crib. That's pretty cool. A lot yeah. of sex? Nah, not really. Not, not really? No. Nah. Nah. A lot of shows, a lot of Red Dead Redemption, a lot of Chicago Fire, a lot of movies, you know. You know, I, I'm going to try Avatar. I'm mean, Avatar. I watch the Airbender. What you mean, the, the game? No, 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 no. The movie? Avatar Airbender, right? Yeah, Airbender. The last I, Airbender. Saw the, oh, I, saw the, I saw the cartoons a long time ago when I was younger. So probably is it a cartoon or an anime? Good question. I don't know. Is, is it considered anime? Oh, Airbender? Uh, yeah, I think. No, it's no, 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 no. It's, it's, it's not a cartoon. It's an anime. It's an anime, right? Yeah. I, I never, I never saw it in Japanese though. I like, I never saw the actual like Japanese. Well, you watching like Airbender as an anime or no? No, I, I did a long time ago. But okay. I, I want to watch a Netflix one. The one that they no, and Netflix like human. Yeah, the, yeah, the yeah, human, yeah. which yeah. I heard good the reviews real, on. The real life one. Great. Yo, Netflix been doing pretty good with all the the transitions. The transitions. Yeah, they yeah. did good with One Piece. Uh, great. They they do, they're doing good with um Airbender. the last Airbender. They I heard they did good with um. What is it? Um, Hawker Show? What is it? The guy with the box? The guy that the box? No, no, no. Some shit Hawker Show. I, I don't what know. What is it? What is it, bartender? What is it? What? What Chris is saying. I don't know. Oh. I don't watch you don't, watch you don't watch anime with Pancho? No. Oh, yeah, That's crazy. That. You should start watching anime. Yeah, 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 I know. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm never, yeah, there's, there's some crazy Let me right put now, this, this out there. And it's not. It's just I cannot get Yo, it. Yo, everybody, if you made it this far. Oh, because honestly, it hasn't been that far. Um, yeah. it, comment down below what's your favorite anime, honestly. Well, yeah. Um, oh, give us a show too to watch. What's your what's Tell what's your guys' shows. favorite anime? 
my favorite anime. I don't know. Dragon Ball Z is anime. Yeah, it is anime. It is considered. And Pokemon, Pokemon is anime. And Pokemon is anime. You know what I'm into? You know what I never consider Pokemon. Even though I know it's an anime, I never consider it. You know what I'm really into right now? Docu- um, document that crime shows. Oh, no more fighting girls? No more, no no more like, reality no more TV? Yeah, yeah, no yeah. More yeah. Baddies. If you watch baddies, you already know. Yeah. Why do they always fight there? And why you don't bring porn. why you don't bring topics from that? Because you yeah. watch a lot of you shit. Lot like of why they fight? Why you yeah, never bring like, like a topic that'd be about great that? For you to like, like why all those girls are fighting? Yo, let's, let's, let's create now live. Let's create a section for bartender. I have a section. Fight, right? fight right? nights for the bartender. Yeah, fight Your section fight is nights. you got a section on Friday, but you don't got a section on the podcast. <laughs> you got a section at the club on Friday. We both with the same. No, you know I'm what not gonna be there. Yo, if you see, I'm not gonna be there. I'm not gonna be there. If you see us. We know haircuts, right? We none of us got haircuts. Right yeah, Bartender right hasn't he, hasn't go to the hair salon in mad long. We saving ourselves for Friday. For Friday yeah. That's why we didn't do shit right, this weekend. We making a movie you on remind Friday. Me, you right? remind me, I need to text my bartender. Uh, my, yeah. uh, oh, yo, your this bar- Friday yeah. gonna be. It's gonna be. This is the title. I got the title. Pre-game with S two D. Yeah, pre-game with S two D in the YouTube yeah, live. Yeah, this Friday. Um, it's gonna be nice. Yeah, we gonna. Love. I might be on camera. Yeah, else. we making a movie on Friday. Sh movie. And the club, you heard, so yeah, you we might see. Yeah, we drinking games on Friday at live. Yo, what's uh, one? What's one slang you guys hate? Slang. Oh, like, I know Marcos. You mean one word? One like, word? Like a slang? Yeah, like a slang. You know, um, facts. Facts. Uh, no, there's that's another one that factuals, y'all hate. Factuals. Demon Yai. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But a lot of people from Dykeman. Yeah, yeah, I hate it. Yeah, yai. but like it became overused for no reason. Yeah. Yo, I, I hate it because my name is Jamie. Hate. So they call me Jay. Jay. Demon Yai. Yeah. But then everybody calls you Yai. I'm like, nah. Bro. Yeah, I hate Yai. What about you, Bartana? Yai, I'm I hate Yai. Think. I don't have one. I hear facts. Facts. For everything. No, facts. if you say it every sentence, that shit is yeah, facts. But the, you know, it facts became like a different. People started saying different stuff like faculty. Yeah, <laughs> facts. That's a Google snap. Is that like a no, 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 no? That's a Google fact. No, 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 Snapple no, no, that, facts. That's, that's a Snapple, Snapple facts. facts. Yeah, that shit is nice. What's surprising. one slang word that you think that one of us like use a lot? Like, what's the slang word that you think Chris uses a it's lot? It's mine. My, I know mine. You know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, you know there was I mean. a podcast you said that I ate. You know what I mean? Is that, is that I, one know, that me him did? You know I, what I, I say? I, you know what I say a lot? Um, feel me. Oh, feel me? Like, you feel me? I never heard you say that. You know the thing I, always is, say, I always say, you feel me? You know the thing with me? Because I, I don't speak perfect English. I just copy y'all guys. No, but you be so saying said, Spanish you heard? ones. You heard? Yo, what was that, what was that you heard? saying the bartender used that Pancho always uses? Um, oh, boofing. Boofing. Yeah, my, 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 yeah, my like, chef boofing. Yeah, your breath is boofing. Yeah, <laughs> I was telling them that their breath was thinking, so I was like, yo, your boofing? breath stinks. Boofing. boofing. Yeah, my chef boofing. Yeah, my chef boofing. boofing. Yeah, yo, like, like, like it's loud. Like boofing is like it's loud. Like yo, like, remember, oh, yeah. when, remember when SpongeBob was talking and like oh, had the smoke walk, on yeah. it. Yeah. New York, yeah, New like York that. accent is disgusting. Like yeah, but people like when you go to different like states, people already know who. Where you I, I think they fetish with us, like in terms of the, the way we speak. Because oh, yeah. we speak mad aggressive though. That's yeah. But we not aggressive. Like, we don't give a fuck. You know, you know what a Jamaic Jamaican shout out to all my Jamaicans. You know what a Jamaican dude called me the other day. Yama. No, no. Well, yeah, they say Yama. Yama. They say Yama all the time. But it'd be like, boy? You know, no, first, whoa, whoa. <laughs> they, they like, oh, naughty boy? No, I, I did the full England accent right you, now. You fish. No, but um, Bati boy means like you, like you gay. But no, I'm not gay for everybody. Oh, you know? Uh, oh, you know? Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Oh, shit. Uh, sorry. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Bre- breaking news. Oh, I didn't know Breaking that. news. Christopher is not gay. Wow. Big gangster. No, no, but listen. They, it's Jamaican dude called me, um, you a Yankee. You a Yankee. Is it American? Yankee. Yeah, well, like, that means? So that means like, yeah, like you're American. You're American, like, American right? Yeah, like. Um, oh, like you, you're, you're not like country or no, no, you're not like um cultured or like from like their culture. Like, oh, you're a Yankee, yeah, you're a Yankee. That's I think you're a Yankee in Dominican. We have to Dominican, y'all. Dominican. So when we look at another Dominicans, it's not really Dominican. In Domin- like, Dominican yeah. world, they smell us that they know that you fall. Yeah, you know what's crazy? That's what they That's what they're saying. Yeah, bro. <laughs> You go to DR and they look at you they, different. No, not you. That's it. No, no. You see when you have, they, let's say if I pull up with these J's over there. Oh, you just want to show yeah, them. Yeah, oh, by no, the way, no. Chris got new sneakers. No, 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 show them. Fuck that. Fuck that. Show them. No, no, no. Listen, 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 listen. Yeah, little cousin be like this. Like put the sneakers next to you. Like, that's on my sale, right? Can you lend me those for Friday? <laughs> I got you. I, said, I, I think I'm going to wear these on Friday. Oh, you going to wear those? Yeah. Yeah, wear those. Wear those. I, I got some other ones. I got some green ones. 
But okay. okay. Chris gave money. Pine, what, pine greens? Chris gave money from the, no? from the SOD live chat. Chris gave money. money yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why you be using the money from the SOD live? Yo, somebody taking that shit. Yo, shout out. Why not yeah, Where's the money? Yo, 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 the, yo, the pieces is hitting, baby. The pieces is hitting? They hitting, baby. They hitting. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Yo, yeah, but. They never miss. Uh, but yeah, weekend, weekend was all right, bro. Weekend, weekend was all right. Yo, before, before, before we go forward, because uh, we promised the fans. The oh, yeah, yeah, the way. Yeah, yeah. So if you're. If you're tuned into the journey, oh, I not, uh, our body transformation, because some people want to gain weight or maintain weight, but just cut up. Some people want to lose weight, and some people just want to like get super buff. I didn't um, so this is our body transformation journey, the 90-day body transformation. This is so the week. first week. The second uh, week, week. No, first week. Uh, no, first week. No, we started last week, so this is technically oh, yeah, our technically first, first week. Yeah, yeah, yeah our first week. week. So um, I'm gonna start with Chris. Wait, wait. So say, last say what week. was what was the our first week start Correct, off? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So for Chris, uh, Chris last week was uh, 223. Yeah. And this week he weighed himself, and he's 20, 200, 220. 220. So I lost three pounds. Three pounds, yo. Damn, bro. Three pounds in one week. Three pounds in good. a week. Yeah. That's not, not, yeah, that's actually like what should we expect? Yeah. Um, then we have Marcos. Marcos was 265 last week. And now he's 263.3 this week. So he so lost like, yeah, like, yeah, like two pounds two, almost. Two, about two pounds, yeah. So. My guy, man, shit. What, man, what have you been doing? Yeah. What have you been doing? Nothing. He, he was happy. Oh, that's, that's DNA? He, 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 has, he has one out. He has oh, one out before the pot. He has one out before the pot. And then I was 210 and I'm 205 this week. But that's water so, weight. Okay, five, so five pounds. No, that's, yo. Know. <laughs> Again, the pot, if you guys want to guess, 300. Yeah, if so you guys don't mind, comment down below. What like is your way? Where you started off at and where you at right now? So that way we we keep we in track. Keep track. We could keep track. Yeah, and also, also so remember far. we have a hundred dollars in a pot each, so it's a three hundred dollar pot. Um, whoever wins, obviously gets the whole gets the, shit. Gets the whole shit, and you guys you guys have to judge it. So yeah. so far, Jaime's winning, right? As far as far as weight loss, as far as weight loss, numbers by the numbers, as far as weight loss, Jaime's winning right now. Yes, sir. We will see the ninety days. You're. Uh-huh. We will yeah, see yeah. the ninety days. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Um, let's talk about. I even I even bought the 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 the. Oh, one thing, one thing, I, I, one thing I want to say too before we start the pod officially. Um, as you guys know, my brother's getting married, and oh, shout out to your brother. Yeah, shout, shout out to Big Bob. I didn't shout know out to that. Big Bob. Shout out to my brother. Shout out right? to Big Bob. Man. Shout out to Bob. My brother's getting married, and right now I'm, I'm his best man, so I'm in charge of like the bachelor party. Mm-hmm. Yo. Shout out to all the women, man. That do this? That plan shit. Because honestly, getting a group of guys, especially guys, trying to figure out what everybody likes and what we got to do and like plan out stuff. That shit is the most difficult thing ever. You want like, me to give you a tip? Like, as far, yo, look, look, like, look. Yeah. Like, all right, we got the first day set, right? Oh, we get strippers, right? But then after that day, like, gonna be there for a couple of days. Like, what else are we gonna do? Like, get strippers every day? Chloe. Bowl party. No, party. party, yeah, like, like, party. So, like, you're like, if you guys have any ideas, please comment down below so we can. How so many days? I, so you can guys help me out. How many days? Um, I'm thinking of doing it from like Thursday to Sunday. Okay. Or like Wednesday to Sunday. So Stripper probably like four the first five days. Day. Strippers in the boat the second day. <laughs> strippers in the club the third day. Strippers in the house. Strippers, strippers in the house. Well, strippers gonna come to the house the first day, obviously, because yeah, you know, they're, they're doing that much. Yeah. Where, where is the location that you planning to do it? Um, that I'm not gonna say that on. Actually, oh. I'm gonna say about because you guys don't know when we're gonna go. So we're gonna go to um, DR, um, either La Terrena or Casa de Campo. Yeah, so that you know, Kai and I went there and he loves it. No, oh, yeah, we're gonna love it. You guys are invited too. Oh, um, thank you. Yeah. Appreciate it. Thank you. Um, one tip for you to focus on, like, what you want to do. Strippers. Go based on what the person. Well, my brother already told me he just wants to have fun. <laughs> like, he just want to party, want to get his last, like, literally his last party, like, mojo out. Yeah? Yeah. yeah I mean, he already been to that stage, so, uh, yeah. Yeah, we're just going to. But he's basically celebrating that he's getting married. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. The How whole point men? is for all of us to have fun. How yeah. many men are going that you think of? Uh, right now, the group chat. Is but we invited, but we not in the group. Shut up! I just made the group chat before we got here. We had no decision. We are deep right now. Right now, there's seven people with you guys. Is nine, nine people, nine people until oh shit! It's gonna be a good group. We a lot of strippers. (laughs) Yeah, there has to be at least twenty strippers. Yeah, like two for (laughs) each, at least. Just just one advice: don't let nobody record anything. No, no, no no phones allowed. No phones allowed. No phones. Everybody gonna have a phone in the basket. Yeah, Yeah. we're gonna do the Drake. Your yeah, phone in the do basket. that because people 
be like yeah. and then put some hot sauce and it's not like niggas gonna be doing crazy shit it's just like yo we there to enjoy <laughs> yeah. the moment yeah we not we in there to enjoy <laughs> we not I, I don't know about you guys no I'm not I'm definitely not I'm, I'm, I'm a faithful young, I'm a faithful I'm young faithful. man but he's single he said we to whatever you want yo I'm literally there to enjoy the weather smoke some hookah I know why Michael don't enjoy, wanna be enjoy some music yo yo oh Jaime you in charge of bringing your speaker Oh yeah, right, I got the big one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just give me the light. You know what hey, my little be recording? Yo, what? Because you know how he be putting the girls on top of his shoulders and shit. Yo, I'll be honest. Yo, Marco, <laughs> what's wrong with you? <laughs> like our Instagram has become a pre-only fan page. Yeah, yeah. It's like the, the amount of ass like this guy pre- has posted in and there. And you know what? He's funny. That he's saying no fun, but he's gonna. He'll be the one that be like, yeah. Uh, yo, I, I, I caught this nigga. I caught this dude slipping. I caught him slipping. <laughs> Yo, but you know that I only post myself, right? Yeah, but, but the I, thing I is seen, that I seen the other people too. The other girls, the, the my my guys' girlfriends, they they be on my Instagram. That's why, cause they don't post everything. So now all I post is myself. So I, I got a question girls. for you. So that day when you woke up, what made you be like, you know what? Oh, the day I that I posted them, everything on, uh, on IG, I want them to look disastrous. Um, the day that I woke, I woke, it was Thursday. It was Throwback Thursday. Okay. I never do. Throwback Thursday. I don't know. I don't know if you do Throwback Thursday. Uh, yeah. I don't know uh, if not anymore. Not yeah. It Wait, was uh, when yeah. it was popping. When it was popping, I never did it. Yeah. So that day, I woke up and I was like, "I'm going to the club next Friday." So you still think about that shit? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to the club next Friday. So I want to put like my mind into that I'm going to the club, right? I'm going to the club this Friday. So I want to put my mind into it, and it was Throwback Thursday, and you know, you know how the comments be in our and our. Instagram and we don't get girls. We yeah, fat. We are ugly. Why girls want to play attention to those guys that do the three podcasts? You know, because we the biggest three palomos yeah, in New York City. The palomo, the three palomo, the hybrid. But, but, but that's true though. I am at least. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, so, yeah, I so I was like, I was like, let me show, <laughs> let me show something that I that I record and never post, and I just went on those posting. You know, you know what I knew it was it was game time. When he posts a Drake meme. <laughs> well, when he posted, yeah, I'm I like, got, oh, it's going got, down. It's going down got, today. I actually got, like, OD in trouble. Like, not in trouble because I don't have a girlfriend, but a lot of girls hit me up like, oh, so it's all look at the I have a saying? question. Um, do you have a candidate to go with us on Friday? Because you said we're going to no take. Girls, we're gonna, no girls. We're take, well, this is somebody. dropping. This on is Thursday. This is dropping on Thursday. Thursday. It might drop on Wednesday, So if you actually. see it. Like the day it dropped, it the next day we're going out. It Yo, might drop I want to actually no. Go being on, serious, go on, go on. Uh, being to serious, answer go on, go on. to answer your serious. question, being serious, I want to take a girl with us that watch. Sorry to disappoint. Like just to hang out with us. So just to hang just, out with yeah, us. Just hang out with us. Like you know what I mean. To be in the table, you don't gotta pay anything. You don't gotta put no money. Just to be with and us, so you can see, so you can see us. It's just to have a brand new experience that I never had. Like let's meet somebody that watched the podcast. Yeah, and I said it. Two pockets ago, I said it in the live, and the one has, has hit me up. So I don't got no candidate. No, no one said you up yet. No one hit me up. Let for me that. say it. If you want to come with us on Friday, DM the studio podcast. Yeah. The bartender will be there too. Yeah. Yeah, so, y'all get to meet me. Y'all get oh, to meet crazy. the bartender, but y'all cannot take no pictures or no, no video of the yeah, bartender. None of that. But we want we want to take one girl with us to the club on Friday, and it's gonna be a movie, and also. And no, it's a let, Spanish, let it's a Spanish on, party. No, we, we got to say this. Hold on. We're asking a girl. We are safe people. Mm-hmm. We are people that are safe. We are good people. We'll, yeah, put, we'll, we'll, put, we'll, it there. we'll put you in the Uber and everything. And yeah. you don't have to do nothing with me because they probably think, oh, no. Marcus want a bag. It's just like it's not we that. want to experience that. Bring somebody that washes a pot to come out with us. That's all we want to do. Yeah. And you're not going to make no line. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Because of Jaime. If it's of me. No, just say Marcos at the door. <laughs> say Marcos at the door, you won't nah, be a piece no, straight from the back. Don't say that because they probably think I'm, 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 ho- I'm hosting now or I'm a promoter. Oh, no, no. He's nah, not a promoter. I'm not a promoter. We're joking around. We're joking around. But yeah, um, I don't have no candidates. Okay. So, answer your so whatever. They don't come, they don't come. They don't come, yeah. All right. So let's go. Let's start the podcast. Let's hit it. Let's hit it. So the question is to y'all because y'all in a relationship and I they like don't. to ask y'all, all of y'all about your relationship because I'm mm-hmm. a... I just worry about whatever y'all do with y'all girls and the boyfriend with her boyfriend. How many years apart you guys are from your partner? I'm a year and a half. So you older than her by a year no, and I'm a half. younger. Oh, you younger than her yeah, by a year Even though when half. we go out, she looks like she's 23. But Okay. Which is crazy. How about um, you? Two years and a half. I'm younger. Younger than your girlfriend too? Two years and a half, yeah. How about you, boyfriend? 
my boyfriend is 10 years older than me. 10 years? El diablo, Damn. Capi. So how old are you and how old he is? <laughs> if you want to say your age. No, I don't care. I'm 29. So he's you're 39. Old. He's 39? I'm about to be 40, I remember, because his birthday is coming in. Yeah. yeah. Um, what so I why think, y'all judging though? Yeah, yeah, hold on. No, I'm, I'm, I'm using this. Wait, 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 wait. And you've been with him for how long? 10 years? No, eight. So he groomed your shit. Yeah. No, he ain't. Oh, he, he groomed you. Shit. Yo, oh my god. The reason why I ask you that. So I think by society, by so, how society, society standards, standards, Chris is good because Chris is just like two years younger than his girlfriend. Jaime is one, no, year one year and a half years. younger. Than his girlfriend. Same so thing. I think y'all good, right? I think y'all good. But the bartender's like younger by 10 years. So when y'all see a couple that is like that much year apart, what do you think? What do you guys think of that? Um, It's either two things. Ella lo está chapeando. Or it's, it's true love. Either or. It's either true or. love in my case. For me, it's like sexual dynamics. So like, Usually, women will always like to date older men. Yeah. Because women mature quicker. When, also, That's when, true. when they have daddy issues. True, but it's more like... No, also, it's more like, men don't mature as quick as women do. Uh, at all. That's I'm, I'm one of them. I haven't matured And also, women, if you, if you look at what women likes, like true love, like a responsible man, financially responsible, all these kind of things, usually men get those things at older age. Like, when we're 22, we don't have those things. For the pod, real quick, real quick. Yeah, they're going to call me crazy. Hold on, hold on. For the pod, real quick. <laughs> no, we we can keep going comments. with the topic, but I just want to yeah. ask you that. How old I am to you mentally? you like 15. I'm, thir- I'm, 30, <laughs> I'm 31. Right? Because mentally, uh, I could mentally, say like, like, I'm, I'm talking about, I'm talking about, like, grown. Like, like he's a grown up, like, <laughs> mentally. You're 15. <laughs> You're 15, bro. Yeah, but no, I said, I said no, honestly, look, honestly, 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 what do you think? 19. I'm no, gonna honestly, honestly, I'm going to give the honest opinion. Damn, I'm gonna get it so, though, for bitch. like, I I, I've been on you for a couple of years now, four or five years. I'm 31. You're 31. Mentally, how And how? I feel like what you do sometimes is similar to a kid that is 25 years old. Yeah, I was going to say the same thing, 25. So, I'm in my yeah, 25. 25 is older. It's too no, you're not even 25. <laughs> <laughs> you're not even 25. Yo, he's 19. I'm going to tell you why. Why? Young people is the only one that be starting rumors. Like rumors oh. about people. Oh, you be starting rumors, rumors. I, I want her to say the rumors now. No, you said it in the live that that's what you like doing. You right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. right, 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 right. Michael right. knows everybody's life. Bro, he, he knows really what get- I part. <laughs> exactly. He you knows know, what you know I part. He, he yeah. act like, like he's your girl, basically. Yo, there was yo, one no, time. Yo, listen. Yo, yo, listen. Yo, girl, there tell was- your girl that she needs anything to know about you to hit on Marco. Yo, hit on Marco. Yeah, you need anything. We have a private security. There was one time I was at work and I, just, I like. I get a, a video from Marcos. You know, Marcos recording my house. Yo, there's nobody in your crib, big dog. I, I, I got you, bro. Don't worry about it. The crib is safe. The crib is safe, bro. Don't worry about it. No, no, but like, like, it's not a bad thing, though. Like, uh, I feel like, obviously, you can mature a little bit more. But 25 is my opinion. It's not the thing with me, I don't like He's people. maturing a lot later than lately. Yeah. He's been more mature. But also, let's put it like this, too. I don't like when a person is too serious, either. Like, Yeah, if you're 45. Like you do too, no, like, no, you acting man mature. Like, you like... 30 and you uh, acting 40, I don't like that. Cause you I think like that. My brother said that though. My, my problem brother? my problem is that I'm funny, even though y'all don't think I'm funny. So I'm funny, right? My life is like, <laughs> it's like, it's like, it's like making a joke. So it's like, with me, it's like, I'm never taking shit serious. O- only when it's very but serious. That, but that's not what mature means though. That's not what mature means. You know, mature means is more. So I'm 25. I'm 25. How old I am to you? Yeah, 25. I was going to say 25. 19 to me. 19? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's crazy. But well, anyways, going back to the question. That's crazy. Oh, you really get your drink. I get my ass. You're like 20. <laughs> going back to the question. So when you when when you, you see, older. When you see a guy that is like 35 and he's dating a girl that is like 22. How do y'all how do y'all look? Do y'all judge? I feel like that's not terrible. I think yeah, it's I mean, the dynamic of the couple. That is old detail. But if you if you're 38 and you're dating a 19 year old. No, yeah, I, yeah, that's you're that's right. So I, I, the question, the thing is, again, women mature faster. So you see when women hit, and you, you're the woman, you can agree or not. When they hit 22, 23, they like 26-year-old men. Yeah, basically. In maturity. So when I see like a 30-year-old man with a 22, I don't see it as bad. Now, I'm not saying and that I'm it's the best something. thing. But it's not as bad. It's getting worse now, though. Like, we're maturing it even quicker. Like, Well, because of jobs, you got more independent. You guys have to yeah. go work just like men do. So, obviously, by 19. But when I see a 35-year-old, like Chris said, with a 19-year-old. Yeah, that's a Especially because it feels like it's grooming, too. Like, if you... Yeah. 
Uh, unless you tell me you met her at 19 and I you look, got look her real at, quick. I look at, at a guy. When a, if a guy is 38 and he's dating a 22-year-old, I look at him crazy. To me, he's like, yo, you couldn't get no woman your age. There's something wrong with you because as a 38 years old, you don't want to date. I don't want to date. I'm 31, and I don't want to date nobody that is 22. I don't, sure no, I don't think a woman at 22. Yeah, but, but I don't then. think a woman at 22 is very grown. I no, was, that's what I'm saying. Been, I have experience with women at 22 when I was younger, and they very mature. No, but what I'm saying, Michael. I know, but you was 22 too. The man is not mature enough to get somebody their age. That's, that's what, what I'm I was saying. about to say. Like, if a man is 39, you need to look at what he has in his life. Is he's 39, but he's thinking as a 29? He's 39, Marcos. Okay, 39, Marcos. So I mean, he's like 27. Yeah. So he can get a 22. Yeah, I know a dude. He's like 33, 34. And he's still hanging out in the college crowd, like 19 year olds. Oh, you see, you, nah, you see, that's that's kind of weird. What do you think of him? I mean, he's what a great he's know? a great person. But uh, yeah, it, it comes to a point like where you have to like just, you know, you have to outgrow that you know my stage issue? of your life. Yeah, you know my issue is that 19 and 18, there's no big difference. Let's yeah. be very honest. Yeah, yeah. And 18 is too close to be pedophile. Yeah. So for me, it's kind of like, uh, nah. Um, I don't know. As, la, a, la, la crecido, bro. as a woman, as a woman, I don't think if a woman is dating a young guy, to me, it doesn't matter. But like if a man is dating a young woman, it matters to me. Like my, my man. I like she's the actually people. the opposite of you. You think they, okay. I think woman, like, because I, I have an experience where I had a, a co-worker that he was... By that time, he was 30 when I used to work with him. And his wife was 50. I've always, I've always been attracted to and older women. Yeah, but this is how bad it is, Chris. She used to be his teacher in high school. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. So, so I, that's me in high school. She was, like, looking so at him a certain that's, way, that's, right? that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's but but, but get, this is the, the interesting part. People don't look at that really. I mean, yes, they do, but not as bad if it would be the opposite way. Imagine if the, if the teacher no. was a guy. Like they will and look then at that after crazy. the girls finish high school, so they will look at that shit crazy. Yeah. No, you you probably go to jail, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know a lot. I know my old high school, and I know a couple of but, teachers that it was hit. But was just what you know, girls. Marcos, you need to understand there are women out there who's 19, mm-hmm. 20, 21 who like older men. Oh yeah, but that doesn't mean they grown though. No, it doesn't. And I think but, that's but, a phase. But, 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 okay, so what are you going to tell this young girl? Don't, don't get no dick? No, 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 no. I think that's a phase, though, because there's women that be like, yeah, I like nah, older bro. women, older men, but when they get with the older men, they're like, what the no, fuck? No, I, nah, nah, I don't think so. I, I every think. woman that I know that been with older men, they just like older yeah, men. Like yeah. older men yeah. They sometimes go older, I too. I disagree. They go older as older they get. I disagree. Yeah. They get to 30, they yeah. get to Everything 50. is beautiful at first. Comment down below. Comment down below. Comment down below. Everything is beautiful at first. As soon as like you want to see that that nineteen year old girl, twenty one year old girl want to be every day in the club, that thirty eight year old guy is not going to be. But with it depends it, bro. because not all nineteen year old girl want to be in the club. Exactly. But not all nineteen year old don't want to be in the club. Yeah, but yeah, I'm but saying. But what we're saying is that they're just talking for hypothetically for one side only, you and too. it's not like no, I no, but I, I think in my side it's way higher than your side. I think the opposite. No. Yo, I think so we're gonna sit here in the pot and talk about that. There's twenty one year old girls mature. No, we gonna say this? Not, that's not what I'm saying. What I'm telling you is, when a girl looks for a guy that is in her in his thirties, that she's she's like twenty, she knows what she wants. She knows that she want to settle down. Yo, I think yes. That's, that's what I'm telling you. Oh, tw- so there's twenty. So I, so I could tell you twenty. Oh, okay, shit, I'll, I'll, give, I'll give you this example. I'll give you this example. Go ahead, go ahead. Do you do you believe that when you have your first relationship, they fall in love with Mac with? Like the the relationship is mad attack. But I always dated a woman like in my the age. First relationship. The first relationship. Yeah. I always dated a okay. woman in my so age. So imagine this picture working for you. Okay. A twenty one year old mm-hmm. se enamora por primera vez with a thirty year old guy. Mm-hmm. That guy is very different than twenty two year old guy. That guy is mature. He probably has his own crib, his own house, everything, everything. car, everything, everything. Probably. probably and, for that, and the girl is his first, probably <laughs> most likely is his first relationship. Esta fisia de tigre. Uh huh. You, I have met so many relationships they last long. Yeah. Super long. They, they even until, die, bro. Until the guy hit 60 and she's my, my grandfather was 80, 90, well, 94 when he died. And he was 10 years older than my grandmother. Until that guy hit and 60. They, and they married for 65 years. I'm, I'm telling you, a girl that's looking for a guy that is older and she's really young is because she want to settle down. Now, there's so I could date a woman that is 22 no, no, but, right now. But no, I'm yes, not saying can. that. Because you're 30. 31, I'm sorry. That's not what I'm saying. You're not understanding what I'm saying. I think he can. It's just, I'm not saying you know go, what the I'm problem not saying go get a college grad. You know the problem that I got. You know I don't date those. You know I don't date nobody that's 21, 22. You know that yourself. But um, you ask I, a question, you know the answer, so I don't get it. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like I don't like I don't like dating women that is younger than me. 
I, that, I always go for the woman that is my age. I love my age. A woman 29, 30, 31, 32. Oh, that's what I love. Okay, I, I, always love that I, always, I love it. I always date older. That's when they whole face go out. Like they no longer. I try, to, I face. try to date older. I try to date older. Older? Yeah. I need I need the I need the cougars to like teach me a couple of things. You be you've been dying lately to be single. Nah. You miss it? Nah. nah. <laughs> you don't miss it? How do you know how do you know you don't miss it? Because I'm good. I'm good where I'm at right now. Do you miss it? How do you know I'm I'm missing what? Like, like single life. You don't you're not missing it? Nah, because when I was single I was just masturbating all day. <laughs> so now you're just getting pussy and you're exactly. happy with that. Exactly. Yeah. I even got a girlfriend just to get pussy. Being single buns. is boring. <laughs> Actually, no, to be it single is, is cool because you can it get girls boring. every two, three Wait, months. How long I, can I, that I, last? I'm not a player. So every two, three months you get something and it's cool like that. But I'm going to tell you something. But there's nothing better than cream pie every day in a singer. But, but also, if your girl is like cool, cream shit, pie, like, yeah, shit. like speaking with my girl, my girl's mad cool. She, she's funny and she's goofy and shit. So I can be myself so you with said my girl. I said, said, said woman's funny. That's what she got? But oh. she's goofy. I could be goofy with my girl, bro. I, I said be, she's I a goofy ass girl. Yeah, like, it's pretty cool when you have. But a the thing girl is, is, it's that. hard when you single because you always have to show off. Yes. When you with your girl for a long time, you don't give yes. a fuck. Y'all both there. Yes. Acting crazy, Why are you at laughing. Because it's true. Repeat, repeat that one more time. They have to what? They have to show off. Why Every you say that, Bartender? Every single time. Because Why? You, you always gotta pay show that you but can what pay, if, take them on dates. What if I'm like Chris? I'm the man every day. What you mean? No, but, but he can't him. be goofy. You cannot be goofy with any girls you talk to. I'm the goofiest nigga. No, you can't. The first day, you're going to be like... Oh, 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 I'm him. I'm Chris. I'm him. You don't even eat the whole plate. You don't even eat the whole plate. I'm him. fat. Chris. And you, you don't eat the whole plate. You, you, every day, you every day him, right? Yeah, I'm Hemothy. But you goofy him. I'm goofy Hemothy. I'm goofy him No, you're not goofy him. I mean, you him Bro, I've seen your messages, bro. <laughs> Michael, you're not goofy every time. You're not goofy. Yo, girl, I, I got it. Because he probably thinks... I got a perfect BAP. Oh, no, no. I mean, he, probably think, oh, he probably think Goofy is like being funny. No, that's not Goofy. I'm funny. Every goofy time. is, is being that you don't, you don't have to worry about why you dressing. You end up you end up by laying down. Probably haven't even brushed your hair. Like, and what you I'm saying. You know what you don't, think, you, don't, you don't think I say that to a woman? No. No. That you, know bed, you, know bed, you know why? You know why? You know why? You know why? This crazy dude went to a restaurant can encontraje with GC Slice to prove that girl that he can do he that. He can do it, yeah. Exactly. You got to show That's up. That's crazy. All right, let's oh. start talking about myself. Okay. <laughs> let's go okay, back. You wanted to ask oh, He asked a question. Give it an answer. He gets Yo, back. hold on. How long should you live with, us, with someone before getting married? Oh. I don't... I think... You would know when. I don't think there's a period of time. Yeah, yeah I don't think there's a period. Yeah. With, within the first six months, minimum. You, you you know, like, yeah, right, minimum. This, this, is, this is for me. Minimum. minimum. He said minimum. Six months. And that's minimum, like you could, you minimum. Could be like, you could give her the ring and be like, yo, let's get it. But it depends how long you've been together. Because if you've been together. Boyfriend only, and girlfriend. Boyfriend and girlfriend like a year and then you move in, that's not enough. But if you've been with this person for mad long and then you move in, it's different. Relationships are different. Yeah, it's yeah. different. Everybody's different. But I'm going to say that the only way you will know is that if you. If you were her for long periods of time and you're not annoyed by her, she's the one. Yeah. I think five years. Because sometimes, bro, you've been in a relationship. Sometimes, <laughs> I think five <laughs> years. I think five years. I think five years. I think five years. I think you should live with a person for five years. And, and yeah, then decide. Even if you've been together for 20? Yeah, five years. I need uh, to know. I, think I, I need with, five I years. I need that. to know. I need to know if but we could be compatible he has, he's for five about years. That he never experienced. Okay. So that's why he's saying okay. five years. I still think five years. I need and, to and know. Trauma. I need to know the yeah, first yeah, yeah. year is five. It's first time we can walk around naked. We can have sex in the kitchen. We Yo, can shout out to everybody who moved into it with a girl after three months of relationship. You brave. No, that is crazy. You brave. Both of my brothers did that. Not and well, they happy, and they've been together for my one is both for a decade, and the other one for two, three years now. Nah, but they brave because they they nah. taking a they taking a real faith leap. Well, it faith it leave is a there. faith leap, but I mean, again, like I said, if you're not mad at that person being together, then probably is the right one. Probably. Yeah. Quick question, you I don't mean to get into. Your I, will, I will tell you everything you need. I will tell you everything you need. Let's go ahead. He gonna answer anything. I will answer you need. Ask him how much money he got in his account because he's really. I'm gonna ask that question. Okay. I thought you was gonna answer everything. Gonna answer everything. Before your brothers got with with the with the wife, with the respected women right now. Yeah. Before that, would they would they like getting chicks? Yes. They were getting chicks. So my big brother is six feet, looking like me. Papi. 
They are getting ying ying get a bitch. Un papote. Papote. Eh? No, you're responsible. You're responsible. You're responsible. Half a million. So, so I'm telling you, like, like, like. Half a million. 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 So, wait. So, he, so he, and he, he, in high school, we used to call el chulo, el chulito, el chulón. El chulón was my big brother. El chulo, my middle brother. El chulito era yo. So. El chulito. El chulito. You know why? So crazy. Because the, 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 the older girls used to kiss me when I was in. Like younger. Yo, shout out to all the women that said that kissed me when I was little. Shout out to all the women that kissed me when I was little. No, you know, Try to kiss me right now. I don't meto. No, no, Let's no. go right now. <laughs> no, we're all, we're all, the, you know, all your, your mom's friends and shit. Wait, 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 oh, man, look how cute he is. Blah, blah. Tell me that uh, now. Uh, yeah. Tell me that now. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, I posted a video that said, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. No, but, but going back to the topic. So, no, yeah. So, my big brother used to get women a lot. My middle brother, he's a shy one. Okay. But he he did date a lot. I feel like I'm shy too. But he he like he he said he has a special type. He like Asian girls. We gonna let that. Yo, gonna, Chris is like Chris said that he. He said that, that he couldn't even be serious. Look at him. <laughs> you know who's shy? I'm laughing. I'm laughing. I'm, 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 I'm laughing. Because I'm because I'm wait, I'm wait, wait, I'm laughing because he said Chulito. Like, I'm just still laughing. Yeah, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say the truth. I'm the too, only I'm shy. shy guy is Jaime. I'm shy. shy. I'm Me too. I see Jaime. I'm really shy. I see Jaime. Well, he was single because I don't want his girl to watch. They be yeah. like, oh, that but no, when yeah, I was yeah. single, when, I, when Jaime was single, I don't talk to them. Jaime was shy. And when Jaime talked to a girl, you see he's a little bit nervous and shit. Jaime yeah. was a shy but guy. But y'all never seen me single, so I'm shy. Yeah. I was shy. No, you're not shy. Nah. No, you're not shy. The thing is, you're the type for to me, be like, the thing the type to me is, like, yo, trying to give me I'm going to be honest. Trying to give me hair tonight. Yo, Chris. You're the type that say that to a girl. You know the thing is with me is that the crew that they go out to, then the woman that approach them, some women will your hair up. All due respect. Okay. And well. every woman that I got in my life are not like so that. Tigre, so I don't know how to approach them at all. So todos los tigres tienen mujeres de la calle, entonces. Todo esto. <laughs> so all, all, wait, wait, all our friends. Wait, wait, disagree. Uh, all our friends. I can say this in the pot. That Let's go one by one. Let's go one by one. Oh, this is a right, Let's go one by one. But don't say names. Don't say names. I'm not going to say no names. Let's go one by one. So, okay, you're pulling me. If you tell me one, relax. If you tell me one from the club that is not. No, wait, wait. Tell me one that's from the club that is not de la calle. I will say quiet. So let me Tell go. Me let me uh, let me go with the question again. So you think in our group friends? Yeah, in our group friends. Nice. Besides Chris, behind, yeah, besides yeah, yeah, Chris, nice. they all got more de la calle, like girls from the street, like they got it from the street. Most women that have been approached in clubs and things like that in the crew that you see me, some mujeres de la calle. So they all in a relationship with a mujer de la calle. I never said that. He said that you saw me in person with a group of women, uh -huh. and I said that most of those women get approached in that group son mujeres de la calle. So you act shy because those women, you feel them. like they're too much to handle? But if that's what you think, too much to handle. No, I think the that. woman that I get is too much for you to handle because you're going to have a conversation with them. You think so? Because oh. you'll be too dumb. Oh. Not because you're trying to take oh. shade. I'm taking shade back. Oh. No, I'm saying. I'm saying, saying if you go to the woman I dated, you won't be able to have a conversation with he them. He said you all. cannot hold the conversation. Oh, maybe. What about yeah, me? Now you probably because. Chris, Marco, be like, let's try. <laughs> okay, let's try. He went to a bar one time and he liked they went to college. He murió me la conversación. But he did go to college. No, no, but, yeah. but he but he specifically said he went to Fordham University. <laughs> and and he, I mean, we've all done that before, no? You was there. No, that day. I never did that. You was there that day. I've I've said to girls I went to Columbia. And I never you was there that day. Why? That day that we went to the jardín de reggaeton. I was in I was in high school. Who cares? Oh, yeah. but no, I'm yeah, talking about him. I'm talking about him, old 30 year old Marcos. I'm not talking about no 19 year old Marcos. I like, I like that you think that about me. Oh, of course. Mm -hmm. I like that you think no, that about me. No, because you said, you said for me it's too much to handle a BBL with trap tats in the ass. I said, I said, and I'm saying to you that you I will never date scared. the girls that I dated. No, I said that you scared of women like not from the street because we're talking about like women that that be outside, women that. That's the word that word incorrect. Like, I'm not scared. I just don't know how to conversation with them. But I asked interested. you if. The reason why you shy is because you think and you heard they are too much to handle. That's what I asked you. And I repeat again one more time that I'm not saying they're not too much to handle. It's just I don't like the interest that they have. When una mujer se viene conmigo, we're uh -huh. very bottles. What the fuck am I going to talk to them about? How much you can't cost? talk about them because you got Alexander McQueen's. I can't. <laughs> mm. You got sneakers that one, are. One thing, one thing I, know, I just noticed about you. What? Oh, it's, so, oh, it's two days. Okay. Do you, now, I'm going to ask you a question. I'm going to ask you a question. Go, go, go. go. Do you like proving people wrong? Do I like proving people wrong? Yeah. Um. Yes and no, because me and Jaime was fighting about who got the best body, and Jaime beat me, so I didn't try to prove him wrong. But uh, do I like proving people wrong? 
that's what I live by. I think everybody does like. So. That's what I live by. That's that's one that's one of my motivation. But why is the question? Why? No, because you was like, oh, okay, let's see. Like, I'm not. I feel like you're about to go get you a girl that's like a scientist. Or something. I already had it. <laughs> Which I one? Already had it. That one that used to go to one. clubs every day. No, the one that you met. She was not from the street. The one that cut you. Th- oh, I'm not. She was not from the street. The one that, that she was very. You? Okay, yeah, yeah. She was very success, successful yeah, yeah, yeah. at her job. I want. I want to make you something clear. Career Getting a woman. job, career wise, doesn't mean the same thing. I'm saying, it's interesting. Yeah, but that, that girl. If I meet a girl and the only thing she likes is hip hop, rap. Okay. Uh, Your girl doesn't like rap or hip hop. No. No. What do no. None of like? my girls like those things. No. No. Mo- 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 yeah. I, that don't, that don't make nothing. That don't make you dumber. Yeah. I'm not saying dumber. Correct from the word. What I'm saying is the interest level. He's saying he's not interested in those kind of women. He's interested that's in what different I'm, that's kind what of I'm women. No, yeah, that's fine. Like if, if I go out to a club and there's a group of women, BBLs, they attracted those women and vice versa because they, they image like that. Okay. You cannot be looking at me and be like, oh, well, you don't go for that. Because first of all, I know from the fact that they're not my type and I'm not their type. So why the fuck I should try that? I'm a very efficient man. I don't try things. Oh, you choose your work. battles wisely. Exactly. Mm. We said that in the podcast one time. Yeah. Choose your battles. Have you tried before? To date a woman Bro. like that? Yes. And how was it? It was too, like, Do you guys know too a, random. Do you guys know anybody that that chooses a, a battle too steep that he can't uh, handle? Yes. <laughs> and, how, and how's that going? <laughs> and how's that going? <laughs> wait, wait. No, no, wait. Chris is <laughs> Chris, Thank no, you. Yo, I came to pod today. Wait, wait, wait. No, no. I came to pod today. Chris, and how's that going? <laughs> well, I don't know. I'm, I'm asking you guys. Okay, I don't, I don't I'm going to ta- ask him. How's that going? Both of them niggas is corny niggas. <laughs> That's Both what, of them bro, niggas. Bro, oh, wait, I'm, wait, you actually have friends like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Surprisingly <laughs> or not. <laughs> Oh, yeah, the acting Both skills of them is niggas. crazy. Yeah, but why, what are you talking about? Well, I'm not even skills. talking about you, though. Both of them oh. niggas. What I'm saying is that <laughs> the issue with a lot of men is that they don't know how to pick their battles. That's why they don't get shit. Okay. Marcos know how to pick his battles. No, 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 and what is his battles? No, no, no. The same you woman at the end. Yo, how do you notice something? No, no, you said that I'm dumb. You said that I'm dumb. Wait, let You said that I'm dumb. You said that I'm dumb. We can go back to you. If I say that, I apologize, but you did. You did. You said that I'm dumb. I don't take that back. And I don't take that back. Like, I don't give a fuck. Me either. So, well, yeah, let's, let's, let's take, let's let's take let's an average look of uh-huh. all the women in the DMs of Marcos. Okay. Prove me not that most of them are alike. Not the same. Alike. I like, yeah, I understand what you mean. Yeah. Right? They have like the same characteristics. Same characteristics, yeah. same idea, same way to talk, same thing. Doesn't mean that they're dumb. Doesn't mean that they're stupid. It just means that they have a type. Mm-hmm. When, and those types are more common in the nightlife. Am I wrong or not? Yes. And that's all I'm saying. You're correct about that. But there are, there are also some anomalies. Yeah, you of know, course. And every day there's anomalies. Yeah, yes. 100%. Okay. There's probably a scientist that swallows Marcus dick. Oh, and we all know that. The doctors yeah, but there's and the like, nurses? There's like a... Yeah, but, but we know about them too. All right, bro. But yeah, there's nurses, a lot of... Nurses too. <laughs> they're like, they're out. There's a lot they're of... Out. There's a lot of smart women. Let's, let's call it like a smart woman that... No. Goals but, for guys from the streets, but that's, he's not talking about smart, not talking about smart, smart or dumb bro. women. He's I'm not talking about smart, smart. dumb women. With this, this by way, woman with no, not, with no interest no, in the no, street no, no, life, no, no, the clubbing no, life, yeah, and still go. Yeah, different interests. Yeah, yeah that's there's women with different interests. The say, let's say the woman that Jaime likes, right? Those women with those interests still they go. Are, for, they are anomalies. They still go. They are for guy, Let's say like he me. He said it right. They are anomalies. They are one that cross interests, but most of the time it's not. Also, another fact for you guys, because you want to like, women with higher IQ are more likely to be single. Why do you think is that? Because, because women that's why cannot deal with dumb niggas. Mm. It's not only that. It's not that. What, so, uh, what, 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 so, so explain. Yeah. It's more. It's more to it. It's the, yes, some, some of them are dumb, but it's also the cheating, the, all of that. Yeah, exactly. But that don't make you dumb because you're cheating, you're not no, dumb. No, no, no. No, wait, wait. No, no, I'm saying That's this. what I'm saying. Women girls, with a higher IQ yeah. tend to be single yeah, because they usually they cannot date with Marcos I never say Marcos You want to say Okay Marcos If the shoe fits If the shoe fits Put it on I don't care <laughs> that's, what, that's what I'm saying I like that nigga Hi man Don't, get, don't take it too personal I take it personal nigga uh, Yo oh. So when you watch that's it You're going to be like a, Oh shit that, oh, that, that's, why you really think, that's why you really think About Big Dog that, That's crazy Nah nah Because you, you attack me I will attack back <laughs> Nah big, big, dog, big Dog is cool Big Dog is cool That's why I never said the opposite About Big Dog I never said the opposite Yo 
I'm gonna prove you wrong. Prove yeah, that's what I like to see, baby. Prove you wrong. Wrong. Yeah, the game is the game. The game, yeah. No, that's the, game the game. That the game is, is the game. And I was, I was out the game. Go back in it. Yo, hold up. When, when can, when can uh, women expect you to unretire? When you come back to the game. When can women expect you to unretire? This is this is a topic I. This is a topic I need. A, I need a yeah. When can um, the women expect you to come back from the game? From the of, game? Out of the retirement, yeah. The thing is, the game loved me. You never left the <laughs> game. The game, because the game loved me. <laughs> if the game keeps loving me back, I gotta. But I'm saying, when are you gonna come back? When I find the right one. When I find the right one, I retire. Yeah, I retire, right? I'm mean, retired. Yeah, I'm, I'm, you I'm, retire. I'm almost retired, yeah. The bartender retired. Well, to be honest, the bartender couldn't like get nobody, so found no one. Me found one. No me <laughs> Close the deal. So anyway. <laughs> Find one, close the deal. Yeah. Yo, so. And it's working now, you know? Maybe I find yeah, one and close the deal. You a hater. Uh, uh, yeah. I hate on niggas on a relationship now because it's been too long. It's mm. been a long yeah. day. It's been a long time coming. <laughs> yo, um, I want to be in March, right? So I want to bring, bring this up. Still single. You guys, you guys ever done like spring break when you guys were younger? Obviously, because we're not doing spring break now. I have never done spring break out the country. I was gonna say the same shit. I've out never out done country. spring break I've outside been of the Mexico. country. I never did. I never did I never Miami. Mexico. I never did um, San Diego. I never did none of that. Jaime never done it because he can't handle it. Uh, Cancun, I did. Cancun. <laughs> he did Cancun during spring break. <laughs> Me yes. too. How how Maybe is that? Handle it. Wait, talk about how was the experience of? I have a like I have a segue to all this. How was the experience to the that? A lot of young girls. <laughs> How you gonna ask your question? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he scratched the shit out of his beard, bro. Can you believe right, it? How was the experience of spring break with the youngins? Well, at the time you was young too, though, right? Well, you never what, done what age you, never you, you were? Like 20, 21? Oh, my bad, my bad. 20, 21? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You done it? Yeah, the time, the time that you wasn't there, oh, 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 oh. I almost got kicked out from the hotel. Oh, my bad. Yeah, my you bad. wasn't there. You didn't know about that lifestyle. Oh, yeah, you were too bad. busy go ahead, doing go ahead, things. Go ahead. Yeah, it was a lot of young girls, that's all. Like so a lot of young, like a lot like of young, a lot, lot of reckless dudes, like going crazy. I don't. Going, there was a guy with a with a with a dick. I think I only was tattooed something in his forehead, walking around. I think for her. Yeah, in the pool part. What about you, Bartana? I think I got it. I personally don't like it. That was you. That was Let me it. See. Yeah, we could put we could put that. Yeah, you can put. I don't care. Uh, what about what you said, um, Bartana? Sorry, I kind of didn't like it. <laughs> it's pretty brave. That was that time. Yeah. But I kind of didn't like it because of the fact that my like, Mexico <laughs> is lit all day. Like all day, 24 7. Right but now, right break, now. Spring break is like this customly. Like, yeah, yeah, it's a it's like, It gets too much? It gets too much. Like, you cannot go to a place and think you're going to have a good time. There's always going to be a fight. Mm -hmm. There's going to be bottles thrown everywhere. There's going to be, like, it's always going to be a mess. There's mad cops. And can't go happen? Yeah. And like, this is why, this is why I brought this up. And this is why Miami is banning spring breakers yeah. this year. And I agree with that. Starting this year. So you know what they're doing to ban, like, the spring breakers? First of all, they had, like, a whole commercial. Like, oh, we don't want, like, you, you ever seen, like, when somebody breaks up with a girl, like, it's not you, it's me? No, they said, no, it's you. It's not me, it's you. Bitch. Don't come like they're basically saying. Don't come over here. Don't come to Miami to spring break. All the spring breakers, they you know, also, and you know what they're gonna do for like the spring breakers. There's gonna be curfew. Yeah, they. Over, they There's gonna be curfew, that. right? Yeah. And imagine Miami curfew, bro. Yeah, they did that last year. But like now they're like enforcing it yeah. to the max. So like let's say if you rent, it's a, oh this young one in Miami, right? Spring break, I'm gonna rent out the Lambo, right? Renting out the Lambo for two or three days, right? <laughs> Yo, at, first of all, I like around no like. Early, I think the the Ten. curfew is like around Ten. nine, if I'm not mistaken. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. The curfew is at nine, and on top of that, everywhere you go parking is gonna be minimum, minimum a hundred dollars an hour. So you can't go to the beach, you can't park the Lambo outside the, your favorite spot. They get to oh to flex on the shorties. So what do you guys think about Miami putting their foot down, saying yo? No more of that. Because, you know, they also did that because, remember, there was, like, a whole bunch of videos before. Yeah, fighting. Not, not just shooters. fighting and people, people shooting people and people shot. people getting hurt. On top of that, trashing. people... Yeah, trashing. Literally. People yeah. would go on restaurants, right? Order their food, eat, and then ditch. Down at, um, uh, what was that called? The, uh, the, dine, dine, dine and Dash. dash. Dine, dine and Dash. They would Dine and Dash all day. You Imagine know? you working your ass off. Mine is already packed because of the... You did your research. 
Oh yeah, I brought this. Yeah. Imagine you working your ass off times ten because yeah. spring breakers is even more people from all around the world, all around the country coming to your city. You fucking working and then somebody just dying and dash. So like Miami's putting their foot down. What I, do you guys I do think have about a question, this? Though. Yeah. Do you, do, what is the percentage of age that goes there? Do you know? Usually is Youngers? the college college kids from like nineteen to twenty three. Yeah, three. yeah from, that's the range that goes there. They also Band like them. The, not only that, like the hotels, they vandalize. They vandalize. They, they yeah, they like vandalize. Trash it. Yeah. Like even in Mexico, like the ho- like those hotels, disgusting. Like it's it's disgusting. I me personally, I always make sure. Like let's say I was like, oh, I'm going away in April or May. I always make sure it's not around spring break. It's the worst. Dude, I so went. I had a good time, but I will never go back. Um, if Miami is doing that, is they state. Right, okay. so I fig- I figure like no, no, it's not Florida. It's, it's only Miami, Miami County. It's Miami. Miami. Miami City. But I'm pretty sure Tampa is probably gonna do that. I think they're Orlando gonna they're probably. gonna end up enforcing that in the whole Florida. Because if you if they don't go to Miami, where they gonna go? Orlando. Kiss Orlando. Orlando. If they don't know, they're gonna find a way. So yeah, I think if Miami is doing that, is I think is whatever Miami wants to do is they plays, bro. Mm-hmm. Like we could like sometimes I wish like there's not a lot of tourists in New York, but Yo. it's New York, bro, and we gotta like. Christmas, but in we made downtown? money out of it though. We made money out yeah, of it. Yeah, but Christmas downtown. Miami saying, we "Yo, don't, we do don't they want use, your money? Do they use Vegas for spring break? Yes, um, yeah, yeah. Yes. but you have to have. Yeah, that's right, how the right. rich kids. But well, uh, Miami's spring more expensive, break. no? No, yeah. Vegas is more expensive. Oh, really? I think Vegas is more expensive because in Miami. Miami you could go to Winwood and pay five dollars for drinks and gotcha. have fun. And but Vegas, in Vegas, Vegas everything is pricey, and Ten, also not just that. You can go to the beach in Miami and oh yeah, just. You know, you cap a bottle between you and your friends and just have a good old time in, my, in the beach. Cause that's yeah. that's basically where all the damage is done in the beach. Yo, yeah. I, I never in been Miami. to Miami on spring break. No, and there's been, like, I don't know if, like, in the past few years when they've done spring break before, like, COVID, a lot of shooting happened. A lot of people have passed away. Oh, no, yeah. A lot, lot of people, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You don't remember that one time that Miami, like, Went crazy. Yeah, you know what's crazy about it? It was during uh, COVID, I think it was. You know yeah, about they it? went crazy. But I hate is that a lot of those things happen for New Yorkers. People don't want to say it. Not just New York. No, no I'm not saying not yes. Yeah. A lot of them oh. for New Yorkers. Like, there's this campaign saying people that live in Miami, they don't want New Yorkers no more. Because they're moving out there. Because we're moving out a lot, yeah. Moving out, moving there. out there and um, spiking the rent, spiking everything up. Spiking the curfew yeah. the curfew is good. If the state like, wants we that. We got the same shit yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like. Yo, but speaking about curfew. I actually wrote, never wrote this topic, but you brought brought it up. Curfew. Um, do y'all have a curfew with your girlfriends? What do you mean? Like when you go out, do you got to be back at a certain time? Like myself or my girlfriend? You? No, how no? No, that's weird. Uh, I haven't had curfew since I was like fourteen. So that is weird. If you live with your girl, let's say you live with your girl now, can you come like every Saturday at like six in the morning? Man, I'm not gonna disrespect it uh, either. So that's a curfew. No, that's, so that's, that's not a curfew. curfew. It's, it's a choice curfew. I'm making. Yeah, curfew is you have a, a designated time by the oppressor. Uh, yeah, by the oppressor. And it can yeah. be that late. So you if cannot, she yeah. would tell him, that's you gotta come in at two. That's a curfew. That's yeah. not a curfew, Marco. She's like, you cannot be that late. No, I'm saying a curfew. Oh, no, yeah, that's a curfew. If you impose. Impose, your time. oh, you gotta be oh, home no. before this time. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, that's a curfew. That is a curfew. I'm saying like 5 a.m. every Saturday. Not even your girl doing that. Yeah, but I'm a man. But your girl's doing that. She's not doing that. I'm a woman. Okay. Not, but so you're giving not, a curfew to they, your girl? She has a curfew. My girlfriend, oh, nah, my girlfriend has a curfew. No. But you don't. You guys don't have... <laughs> what happened? Nah, you guys don't have any friends that are in a relationship. In a relationship that, that your friend got a curfew, like your, your male friend. Yo, I haven't seen something like that, honestly. Like controlling boyfriends to girlfriends um, since... That's like I feel like that's high school shit. Like some little kids. And also mature relationship. Wow. You yes, do it from natural like... Like you I know, think, I don't have to tell you. Don't so come every time. I think it's because wow. you, it's the couples you surround yourself with. If you surround yourself with couples that toxic fight, so no, no, do yeah. all of that shit, no, have no, a the, curfew. So hey, what did I say before? So yeah, I don't know. So <laughs> it's toxic. So curfew doesn't exist then. So I'm just saying nothing. Like no, curfew does exist. There's a relationship out there that they yeah, do curfew, curfew. Relationship curfew. That's a controlling exist. thing. If you, if you but you access in our personal life. life. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, no. I think, like, if y'all live with your girl, I don't think y'all could come Friday at 5 a.m., Saturday at 5 a.m. I don't think y'all Every could week? Do I don't think we can either. I don't think I don't think do it. I can, but it has to be an explanation. Yeah, like, I, That's I, gotta, disrespectful. I was out with my boys. That's the explanation. Every I mean, single yeah, weekend? Like, every single week, probably the first weekend, probably the second weekend, 
might slide, but after that, like, yo, what you doing? Like, you chilling? Like, yeah, what the fuck? Because it's doing? also like how you see your girl. Let's say that's the time that you have to see your girl because y'all both work all week. Mm-hmm. So y'all gonna be in curfew? Okay. After no, y'all do it, like, think so. after y'all do it a few times, y'all yeah. Gonna but I think that's ne- not curfew. I think, you, I think you're confusing curfew. He's using the, a negative connotation of you yeah. deciding to stay home because you want you no. spend the last. Because I think curfew okay. is like, oh, you have to be here at two a.m. If you pass two a.m., there's consequences. That's but, curfew. But it happens a lot often. It's very no, often. it does. But Marco is trying to insinuate like if that's what we have. No, no. that's not what I have with Pancho. <laughs> <laughs> Just the name, bro. The name is crazy. <laughs> Why she said his name? I tried to. Pancho. I gotta change his name. <laughs> I, got, I gotta change his name, bro. We Actually, gotta give him a name. name. Let's give him, like, Loopy. They call him Loopy. <laughs> Pancho. Pancho. No, but what I'm the saying. The way is, she said it, like, that's what I had with Pancho. Because I was thinking, I was gonna say something else. I had to think Yo, about oh, it. That's man. fucking hilarious, bro. Oh. But what I think is. Have y'all been in a relationship that they gave you a curfew? No. Let, let me ask you. I that. was, yeah, oh. I wasn't one. I you was were? Oh, you were? Yeah, yeah. I was not. They tried. They didn't work out. I said, that's right. Yo, look. Literally, like, it was, I, was, I was almost in a relationship like that. But I had to cut Shorty off. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, I was talking to Shorty. Mind you, you know when you first start talking with a girl first week, you know, you want to say something cute to her. Like, you know, you say something cute back to me, you know. Hello, me oh. Boom. I'm thinking the, the shit, it's going like that for a little bit, right? For like the first couple of days. <laughs> After that, I don't know. It's like, oh. Why you didn't Why you didn't call me as soon as you got home? Oh, why you didn't? I'm like, yo, yeah, girlfriends don't do that now. Nah, I don't nah, know. No. I'm like, yo, bro, you're not even my mom. Like, chill out. Like, my bad. I was I was a baseball I practice or some shit. My I bad. Know, I know your girlfriend. Your girlfriend do that. Hell no, my girlfriend does not do that. Do what? I okay, guarantee you. Like, 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 um, if he gets after home, you gotta text him. No, I do. What I do is. Not to, like I'll let you know I'm home for safety. Yeah, yeah, that's it. But it's not. Oh, I had to say by a certain time. No. If my boyfriend's sleeping, I'm not calling him. You see what I'm saying? The surroundings that he yeah. portrays yeah. is different than what too much, what too much negative stuff. Too man. much negative stuff, bro. That's what you cannot handle. The it. thing is, also, you <laughs> know, you know what also depends. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Why you, know you guys lying no, crazy? You in know the what pot. also depends on. Let's say your relationship, right? You're with this person, and this person, y'all together, y'all don't go out often. What about if I don't know where she's like, oh, I'm gonna go out, cool. but she don't go out as often, and she end up coming at four in the morning. You gonna be mad at her when cool. she don't go out often? No, 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 no. I will ask her where she's going. Obviously. No, because obviously she's telling you. Oh, okay, no, no, yeah, no, no problem with me. You th- you would not be okay with that? Yeah. She you know, it's a difference. But, but but not like now if she's changed like now she's going out every weekend. Every weekend. No, yeah. no. I'm saying like I don't know where, like one oh, night, oh, I'm gonna go oh, out. Oh, it's a difference when you tell somebody, yo, let me know when you're home. Yeah. I'm going out with the girls. All right, cool. Go out with the girls. Just let me know when you get home. That's the difference between saying, I get home at twelve and you better call me when you get when you're on the cab. That's a totally different thing. Yeah. Okay, so I do my thing is cause even let's say let's say my boyfriend's here and he leaves, I always be like, Let me know when you're home. I mean, for Bro, me, it's safety. Because if I know if he didn't tell me and I haven't heard from it, either something happened. Yeah, you know how many toes yeah. I got him back in, back in the days? When for forgetting? Used, yeah, and go to sleep and shit. It's like your mom. Let me know when, you, when you're there. You yeah, don't call. Okay, so she I got a question tight. for you. So uh, when's the last time you guys have a curfew in general, like family? Well, I like never had one. Like, four, four, still th- have. like 14, th- really? 14, Marcos 15. had one, but I didn't. Well, I still have. So, so you said 14. Right? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I, had to, I had to put my foot down in my crib. Mm. So you no. say, you're saying when you were 16, you can go out no, and No, the come thing back? with me was that my dad used to work overnight, taxi driving. Uh, okay. So let's say I'll be, so I'll be like, oh, I'm going to go out. He would take me to the place. He would take me and all my girls to the and to the party. And then he'll be like, I'm going to pick you out when I leave back home. He would go back home at 4 in the morning or 5. So I'll have enough to party. Yeah, and he'll yeah, pick me up. Yeah. So the thing with me was like, I used to tell my mom, he's picking me up. We're going home together. What so about my you? Mom never I still, I still have a curve. Michael still got one. Yeah, I still have You never respected them. You like I never lady. respected my mom. <laughs> <laughs> you always come like, yeah, my but you know what's mama. funny about my mom? My what? poor mom. she would be like, traeme comida. She'll be laying on the couch waiting for my. <laughs> well, like here, sitting? <laughs> yeah. No, sometimes you've been getting home like at 6 a.m. I mean, she's still waiting. Yo, if you tell her that you bring her food, oh, she's I, waiting. Oh, that's, oh, that's um, one. Since y'all in a beautiful relationship, y'all three, right? I'm going to ask y'all Chris and Jaime first, and then I'm going to ask the bartender. Since y'all in a beautiful relationship, and your relationship is working out and it's so perfect, and I hate, and I hate on y'all, all right? How do y'all obsess, like, obsess your girl? 
like that. Like, how wait, can you what? obsess? Like, what you read? Como tu puedo obsesionarla? Like, to make her be that way? Yeah. With the Because I feel like y'all girls are obsessed with the right? How can you get a girl to be a obsessed de, a, with you? A, a dale con la manguera, bien. Yeah, That's yeah. it. That's all. That's all. Okay. Nah, you gotta get a... He wants a real one. So he wants a real one. Tate tranquilo. Tate tranquilo. Tate tranquilo. Tate tranquilo. Tate tranquilo. I can y'all obsess your girl like that. Like, I want to obsess... Give me the, the pointers. Like, do this. Do this. Do this. And a girl is going to be obsessed. You know what it is? I, I, oh, go ahead. I, I'll tell you this. Um, For you to make your girl... Damn. I don't know. It's going to sound very... Like, say it, say it. You got it. Like cocky and shit. You're in a beautiful relationship. Like, it's just number one thing. You always got to be honest. Well, at least me only because because I'm gonna speak from my experience. I forget everything. So if I lie to my girl, bro, she's gonna catch me my lie. Yeah. And I and I can't say shit because I'm, I'm gonna forget. I'm like, yo, I don't even know what the fuck I said. She's probably telling the truth. But if I'm telling the truth all the time, bro, there's nothing she can so say. Tell like, the yo, truth bro. all the time. You, tell the truth all the time. What yeah, else? Tell the truth all the time and don't. Don't give any information that she doesn't ask for. Okay. That's, that's how it. you obsess your girl with you. No, I don't think that's how you obsess your girl. Yeah, that's yeah. me. But I feel like that's how you could make her trust you to the max. No, but I, I think so. She goes to like, oh my God. But she can a, trust you a lot, but that doesn't mean the obsess. Obsess is a little bit different. But I feel like it all depends on the, the obsession. The obsession is a, lot, is, a, is a lot of shit. Like, you got to give a d- good dick. You got to, um, yeah. you got to wind and dine all the time. You got to make sure you call her beautiful every day. You got to do, you, there's a lot of shit to it. It's not, it's not like just. I think it's an act So, like, at the beginning, she always going to be, if it's a good relationship, you're going to be obsessed with you at the beginning. Always make her feel important. But then she's going to die, she's going to die down. And you have to surprise her with something. But whatever it is. Make her feel important every time. Every and single time. And then it's going to go up. And then, yeah. That's the only way. Yeah. So that's how y'all says you all that's why yeah, my mom that's been obsessed. That's how, that's how you did, yeah, yeah, did it? Yeah. That's why my how mom you, been obsessed with his husband for 20 years. How about you, Bartender? How you did it with Pancho? How you got him so obsessed with you? I that he doesn't want to leave Why are you so obsessed with me? I think it's communication, too. Communication only works for women, though. No, when women be like, communication is the key. No, because it's the if key I, if no, you hear what you want to like, you what you want to hear. No, this is the not. kind of things that Michael says. No. It makes me read that what I said before. Very smart, man. No, that's not true because the communication thing is, is only for the if woman. If I sit there and I'm tight, right? I'm tight, right? And you keep asking me, "Oh, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you?" And I don't want to communicate. It's only for the woman. No, because you asking me what's wrong. We really do not care to be so honest. So why are you asking? Because nah, you got a face. Nah, I think communication. And is, my mom is there, and you got a fucking face. Yeah, the no. communication is Dude, woman need to vent to men, and men need to understand. No, but and agree men, with women regardless. No, yeah, men no matter what. To woman. No matter what. A good relationship is where you could bend to your woman. Uh, yeah. Com- uh, good communication is always yes. agree with what you she says. I disagree I like with that. I like it on my nah. booty. It's hole. very difficult. Whoa, whoa, so you don't whoa, bend whoa, to your girl? Whoa, whoa. Tell very, me very, very difficult. Whoa, whoa. They, you are we just going to disregard what he just if you said? Bend, if, you, if you bend to your girl, are you be like, I like, I like it on my booty on the y'all break up, she's going to say it to everybody. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Uh, uh, do you guys bend to your girl uh, often? Um, not too, too often, but sometimes you have your vulnerable moments. You vent? I'm nasty. When I was in a relationship, the only thing I used to tell my girl, like, vent, was like, there was like four girls at the gym and they like were looking at me and shit. <laughs> That's not venting. That's my venting. Mm-hmm. For her that to be like, when you're oh. having a bad day, you be like, yo, I'm having a bad day because yeah, it's bad. I, I don't. Girls don't want to hear niggas bad days. It's bro. not even that. It's just bad days. That's why you don't. Then, you, you don't know what's have funny? A they get mad. Oh, you like, you like listening to your to your boyfriend. Yeah. Bad day. Yo, Marcos. Oh, you got anxiety again? Tell me what, what what's going on now? <laughs> no, I do like it. You like when your boyfriend yeah. tell you his bad day? Yes. Like, I was at work. He and my but boss treated me all the bad. That's not how it is. So how it is? How is oh, that? let's say, oh, I'm in the middle of the highway. My car got fucked up. I'm tight. That's you like hearing it. that? Yeah, if you want to tell me that, then yeah. Why not? I don't. I usually don't bet. I usually don't bet. Yeah, I try, I try not to. I try not to. Nah, you try know not what's to. interesting? We all three say no, and most men don't bet. I try not to. No man. Try, try. Yeah, I try not to. No man vent. And then when a man vent, like he's going through a lot of shit. He took as his Their girl start like, oh my God, he vent to me. But when he do it the second time, like, yo, this nigga no, got they mad. Do that. Problems. A real problems. girl, that's why your relationships problems. don't work. Oh, bro. Like, <laughs> they hate me because I said the thing. And then that's what your relationship Chris, don't you work. have to beat off again? <laughs> yo, one day. You need to switch it up. I don't need to switch <laughs> nothing. Oh, oh, you have to switch up the hands? Right. No, I'm going to I'm have to try that. I'm going to have to try that next time. What? Switch up the hands. It works? I think if you do it like this now, like it's better. 
Oh, no, like it feels know. different, yeah. I, Yo, I que para eso, every time, every time you meet a new person, do you trust them right away or no? <laughs> Uh, no. Hell no. What the hell? Hell no. A cool new person. No. No. Yeah, you, you ever been? You ever been to a resort, right? To answer that question, you ever been to a resort and like you know those those people there just yo you at the bar, oh, hey man, where you from? Blah blah. I always lie, bro. Yeah. Always lie. Faithful. Yeah. Well, why you don't trust them? You think they gonna do something to you? No, nah, cause I, I, bro, I don't fucking know you. I'm not gonna tell you my life story, bro. That's not weird. <laughs> What's your life story? Whatever it is. <laughs> I want to hear your life story. Whatever, whatever my life story is, I'm not gonna tell you that. I think it's not if I'm if I'm a bum, if I'm a bum that don't do shit, I'm not gonna tell you and that. And trust me, if you're drunk, you're not gonna sit there and tell them Hello. everything you've been you through. You think your shit. life story is like fire? I'm gonna write a book. What was your life story? No, like, I, I, I would wait, 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 wait for, for the book. book. <laughs> I mean, you think your life story is fire? Nah, my shit is trash. Oh, my shit will be boring. My shit will be boring. My shit is all be boring. Until I get to Colombia. Oh no, yeah, that that when, chapter when like that will be good. When I get to talk yeah. about vacation. I, I got a I got a friend that wants to go to Colombia with y'all. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah. dying dying to go to Colombia with, with a, like with a group of guys. I think it's too late for me. Too late for you. Damn. Oh Michael, look, you got a homie now. Too. Got a homie, yeah, I got a homie. Just let me know when y'all going so I can let him know so he can book his uh, shit. Asking Marcos question about um, if you trust people. No, but like if like your thing about not telling your story, I don't, my story is boring. It's you not know? even about like your like story. They ask me what, what you work. Oh, I'm a developer. Okay, cool. Like no, I'm not gonna hide. I'm it. not gonna. But I'm not gonna tell anybody that I'm I'm doing this or that. No, I'm I'm gonna say uh, I work at McDonald's or some shit. I'm so, not gonna tell you what my real shit is, bro. So what's yeah, the point? Like me, I don't find no point on that. But I also don't find a point of hiding either. That's that's what I'm trying to say. Because I don't want hiding, you to know who hiding, I am. Hiding. No, because you're not hiding it. You just don't want to talk about it. It's think, but, but, but he said, but his scenario specifically was, if you're in a bar and you saw something super cool, yeah, you lie so you and could get drinking, out the way. You got a tipsy, yo. I work at this. Where you work at? And in, in my mid drunk happy moment, I'm gonna be like, this nigga, I'm gonna say McDonald's. But you well, don't I'm think about a, it. I'm like giving that. a random example, but I, like, like let's say, like, I trust everybody. Usually, the conversation goes is, hey, how you, how long you guys here for? Couple of days. I'm not gonna tell him exactly how many days I'm I always think people okay, yeah, okay. I always I think I'm wrong then I'm thinking the opposite of you. I always think a person is a good person, always. I don't know why. Well, me too. I think most bad. most like it's a good I person. always every time I meet somebody, I'll be like, Oh, he's cool until I find out that you're not cool. Yeah. But I always like have a clean slate for you. So like I will trust you right away. Because what if that guy you're talking to or the woman or whatever, maybe maybe it's more with guy with guys with me, because I could probably trust a woman more than a guy. Oh really? Maybe, maybe. Okay. But I won't Bro what if the guy Sitting next to you Is a fucking serial killer Bro He's just like Trying to find out Who he, who you are So you can You're, you're part of his His hit list now Okay For me yeah. Are you saying The chance are very low For that I right just there? think For me is If I go on vacation I'm not gonna talk about What I do back home I'm having fun here Why I need to tell you Like I'll be like Oh yeah I do this That's it I'm The end of the conversation I agree It's just that yeah. I don't think about those things Like if they ask me I say yeah, I don't care Yeah okay. so. Yo to uh, to change the topic a little bit, mm-hmm. what a what a person that y'all met and y'all was so surprised that y'all met that moment that y'all had a wow moment. Did y'all met somebody before that y'all was like wow? No. <laughs> I saw Johnny Ventura one time in the in the Dominican parade, but well, it's not it's not well, like a really wow, wow moment. It's just you like, never, y'all never had a wow moment. But what is it wow though? Like like I'm, I'm like surprised. Like like wow, I met a, I met this person. Y'all didn't feel like that about me. Uh... <laughs> No, no, no. I'm like Chris Brown. I played ball with Chris Brown. That was my wow moment ever. I played ball with Chris Brown one wait, time. Wait. He cooked you. Yeah, he's he nice. cooked he's us. Nice. He's nice. At one thirty eight in Abs, no, one thirty two in Amsterdam by City College. We played ball. Lappy, you, you met him. Maybe if I meet him, I'll be like, "Wow, so I like him." But I'm not gonna. Whatever Lappy just says, you like, hey, I, actually, I've met a Lappy before. I've met a lot of before. Like I've that I've was not a wow I've, moment. No, it's it's not. The human beings, bro. Now, to me, Chris Brown was a wild fucking moment, bro. I don't have wild moments with, like, human beings. I could probably go, yo, know, when I went to the planetarium when I was a little kid. That was wild? That was a wild moment. That was the first, thing. Like, oh, shit, I'm sitting down in this old. So time. none of you have a wild moment. You just had the planetarium. <laughs> the planetarium when I was a young kid. And you never, y'all never had a wild moment? No. Like, a major You didn't have person. a wild moment when you got your car. That was not a wild moment? But you said person. You said person. Yeah, but a person or a moment, like, a person, let's let's keep it, not never, not never, never had a wild moment? With a person, with a specific, with a specific person? No. I had a wild moment when they like get to comment on the clip. 
Ye yeah, how big the wall okay. Shout out to the homie there like yeah. Yeah, but how big the wall. Don't get to comment on the clip. So how big the wall moment should be though. That's what I'm trying to say. To me that that was a big moment. No, but okay. There are things that amaze you. There are things that surprise you. There was a wall moment. moment is like shocks you for your entire life. That's why Yeah, Chris Brown shocked me for my entire life. De la ghetto. Actually, that's pretty that is pretty cool that you play ball with Chris, Chris Brown. Brown. Yeah, yeah the Laghetto cool. comment on the clip that was a, a shock me for my entire life. Even if it's corny, that was a comment. This is a crazy I'm gonna that say. was that, that shocked me for my entire. Not shocked me the kid. I'm still in shock, but like, hey, like, hey, like I almost crashed on the highway, my nigga, when I saw that nigga comment. What's the name of this when, nigga? When Pelotero? Romeo Santo, when Romeo Santo photographer comment too and liked the video, that was a wow moment for me too. Okay. For when you, they right. recognize me in the street, that's a wow moment all the time. Like, yo, you the guy from the podcast? I I, I got to, like, take on myself. I wouldn't look at myself all the time. So I'm the only one that have wow moments? Seems like I don't... Well, people know. Oh, you niggas are so cool. No, it's not we cool. It's not like, cool. It's just I haven't been... I got that put So when, on Friday, when the guy says your name in the microphone, the, the famous secret. artist... Uh, secret, uh, secreto says... Uh, when secreto, when I tell so, Secreto... Sorry to sorry disappoint. When I tell Secreto... Yo, say in the microphone, shout out to Chris and shout out to Jaime in Spanish. That, would be, I, that would be super fire. Fire. That would be fire. But would it be a wild moment that I remember my entire life? No, my God, Secreto said my, my name. Because he said my name? No. Wow. You guys are the coolest. <laughs> shout out to the cool kids on the block. What's the biggest light you Wow. What's the biggest light you ever said? The biggest light. You only said no. That you told somebody. The biggest light. Yo no hice nada. <laughs> um, trying to remember. No, my memory is gone. You gave, me, you, gave me, you, gave me, you gave me chlamydia, but it was me giving it to her. Yeah. I never had an STD. No, he said his experience about, like, that was my he got chlamydia, but she said that it was I, him. I, 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 but I he knows he didn't her, have nothing. I got, out, I got it from somebody else. I blame it on her. That's my biggest lie. I loved you. Another lie that I said. Probably my biggest lie was when I was in high school. I used to I used to go up to Albany. I used to tell the girls I, w- I was gonna be a doctor and shit. I was <laughs> in Columbia. That was, that was a huge lie. Your shoe size is a lie too. No, my shoe size actually. What size do you think my shoes are right now? Nine and a half. Yeah, nine and a half. What gender you never told a lie? I'm pretty sure I have, but I don't know. The biggest one was my boy told me to tell a girl in the bar that I'm from I'm I'm an Emirate. Emirate is uh, from Dubai. From Dubai, from, from Dubai. Dubai. Um, and they laugh because my accent. <laughs> Nigga, you from the yard. <laughs> well, you said that. Or, or telling a girl she's cute. So, that's probably a lie. So, no, no. So, yeah, that's a big lie. Um, so, the reason so why. So, why you even say you? Because you, right, you're trying to back. You know, no, now you're trying to back. You, so, way, you're trying you're, to back somebody ugly. You're, you're, no, try, you're, you're the wingman like, man to your man. Exactly. Like, yo, oh, yo, yeah. shorty, you cute. But you so, that happened because my, like, my, my, my boy water. has a girl. My boy had a girl in that, in that, cl- in that bar. And the, the girlfriend was there. And the girl, he, I don't know how he knew, but he knew that she liked Indian people. Like people from there? Yeah, Middle Eastern. And he said, you have to be exciting. Tell them that you're for Emirates. <laughs> I'm I, I use that all the time. I use that light all the time. And to be exciting. I never said... Nah, let me let me not say that. But I told a girl from the I told a girl in the other I was gonna bring her over here. That's a lie. Did you ever bring her? No, but that's a lie. We For now, it's a lie. Los viajeros siempre dicen eso, right? Like, te voy a traer, sí, te voy a traer, te voy a traer, mi amor. Tú eres mi vida, mi luna, mi sol. Tú eres mi luna, mi sol. ¿Cómo están esperando, Sabi? Están esperando. A mí me están esperando en Colombia. ¿Cómo es? Elisa. Estefanía, Estefanía, Estefanía. Shout out to my baby, man. I actually want to say shout, this. I want to I want to shout out Schoolboy Q's album. It was a really tough album. Yeah, um, a lot, lot of little rock stuff in there, but I fucked with it. I fucked with it. My mic went. Um, I actually want to give a shout out to. Let me see because I'm looking for this. It's my request. Um, my bad, my bad, my bad. Oh, yeah, yeah. Be with me. Be with me. Be with me. Oh, Perez. <laughs> Um, now I just want to give this shout out because I cannot find it right now. I want to give um, this guy. The, I want to give this guy a shout out. There was a guy that sent us a DM and sorry to disappoint. And the guy is in the in the military and he's deployed somewhere else. I don't remember what country they got him over there. And he told us that believe it or not, he watches all the time and we and we make him feel like he's home. 
I guess he's from New York and he's in the army. I don't what know if it's the Navy. Navy oh, or he's the in the army. military. He's in the military. He's in the military. He has deployed in, in another country. And I don't know. I read that like on a Saturday at four in the morning. I went to the DMs and I, I looked at that and I was like, oh shit. Like sometimes I wonder, like, do people listen to us? I know we see the views and we see the clips and people comment, but sometimes I don't know if they really listen to us. Like, it shocked me. And I just want to give that guy a shout out. I forgot his name. I will say his name, even though I don't know if he wants me to say his name, but he was like, yo, y'all made me feel like I'm home. Thank you for watching the, thank you for like watching episodes, like, P- the p- putting out episodes Putting out episodes For for me Because it made me feel like home And that shit hit me So I just wanna Like Hope you get back home man Yeah And that shit hit me That's that's all I wanna say Now that's yeah um, and Also thank you for your service bro We didn't speak about this Um, You guys saw the Putin interview? The what? Putin the Russia Russian oh, no, no, What about him? He did, a, he did an interview with um, a Tucker uh, You guys know Tucker from I think he used to work in CNN I think A okay. whole interview? And you didn't send that in the group chat? No, um, I thought you. I thought you saw because you like All to right, see what, things. What's, like that. The, no. what, what's the gist of it? What's, what's so going basically, on? Tucker is an American YouTube. Now he became a YouTuber. Okay, uh, but he's a politician, YouTuber, whatever, and he was able to pull. Went to Moscow and did an interview with the with, with Putin. Mm-hmm. And bro, that guy is that guy is stoic as fuck. Like the way that the interview was like, yo, like you ain't nothing. Like you right now, I'm your daddy. <laughs> he was did in that interview. That ass? Wait, Putin was like, Putin yeah, Putin was, like, Putin was like, I don't care about your little YouTube. This is what we do. This is what we uh, how we roll. It, it, it was pretty cool, interesting how the perspective of him. wasn't was Putin talking English. Yes, yo, Speaking send that in the chat. Like that's major, bro. That's like doing an interview to the South Korean, um, the uh, North J- Kim Kim Jong Hoo. Yeah, that's yeah. The, wait, hey, wait, 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 thank you. Yeah, wait, thank you. Don't don't be. Hey, um, I also want to shout out to LeBron James for dropping 40,000 40, points in the NBA. Yeah. 40,000 first player ever. La and fucking I, lebra, coño. And I'm happy for that because it's a black guy, you heard? 40,000 points in the NBA Hall of Fame. I tell you, that's it's not going to be Steve Nash, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Steve I just want to give a shout out um to LeBron. Oh, I also want to shout out, shout out, Braun, shout out Braun. to Meek Mill dropping an EP. It's actually number one in the world and all genres right now. Number yeah, one in the wait, world. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Independent right now. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. How is it number one? Uh, you want me to show you? My, yeah, he sold 3,000 first week. How much you want me to show you? It's number he one. Sold in, it's, no, it's number one in Apple Music right now. But I'm not going to hate on Meek Mill because the project. No, 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 no. Not just that. The project, the project was really good. I'm not going to lie. The project was good. Why he sold three thousand? Only you think? Oh, uh, he's independent. He's independent. Um, so he he's gonna see almost all of that money to him, or yeah. most of it. So in the long run, he he is. Oh, it is number one. It's but number that one. was his picture. But what is number one right now? I don't know. This is um five hours ago. Number two is Cool Boy Q. Number three is Kanye West, and fourth is Twenty One Savage. But he's number one in Apple Music. I don't uh, know. Number shout, one. Out, shout out to me because that was actually a pretty that good. Album, that, was a, that was a good project. No, it was not an album. It's, it's an EP, EP. EP. That EP is, it comes with five songs. Um, lately, um, Meek dropped a mixtape, and I didn't like the mixtape. Um, his last album was okay, and I feel like my guy was like holding good music back, and he dropped his five songs. I'm a crazy Meek Mill fan, and this life five songs is fucking fire. Regardless of what happening with Diddy and Usher, regardless of that, it's good music. If you like like hood rappers, rappers from the street, this is a this is good music. Yeah, and good, I like that. I like five project. songs. It it's project. crazy. That and one for that Diddy conversation, go to the live the previous one we made. Yeah, yeah we, we spoke did, about we it. We did speak about the Diddy stuff and me and all that stuff. Also, we made also, a lot of jokes there. If you got the tickets for Aventura concert, fuck you. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, you so got the yo Aventura tickets, that, fuck you. I think Aventura really still got it like that. Yes. Yeah. I, my whole Instagram yes. was flooded of just women yes. posting, posting, yes. posting, posting. I think posting, it, it posting, got it because posting. of, of Nostalgia. Yeah, it, yes. But, Bro, was, but the way you got it, like what, like they became like, new like music? Still, like, yes. they, they still like the kings. Like they still yes. do. Like, yeah, 100%. Yes. Those are. They can fill stadiums still. Yes. Stadiums. Oh, but they are yes. right now. They, they are, are yeah, going to. Yeah, yeah. Stadiums, they yes. Yeah. They still got it. Like the way you don't think Romeo Santos. You don't think they got it? But I asked a question. You don't think you got They don't got it? No, I was asking you guys. Do you think Romel's doing it for, for them or for the people? Um, I think he's doing it for himself, too. I think... Because his last but he, album kind of flopped. Yeah, but he still sold out staying by himself. He's still making money. But not like Aventura did. His took a time to be sold out. Oh, really? Yeah. They didn't sold he, out. 
Good to know. I though. think he's dropping a new album. With them. I'm not mistaken. With, with, them. with them. yeah. I yeah. think if there's a new okay, album coming out with the last one. But I'm, I am, I got tickets, I'm going to Aventura. What I'm going to say is, I do not want to hear your new music. Aventura. I don't care. Oh, you want to hear the classics? Uh, yeah. Everybody, everybody, everybody wants to hear the that. classics. Everybody's saying, if you drop new music, do not do it. I think, this is, I think they are. This is it. the Dominican's Michael Jackson to us. I'll be, I, I will go. No, no they're like the Dominican Beatles. They're yeah. Dominican, Can we they're say, a group. yeah, it's a group. Can we say that Aventura is bigger than Dominican Republic? Can we say it? Because uh, I, 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 I hear what you're saying, I but think I think they, they're bigger. They are the only people that are very, like, international. Yeah. yeah. They are very, look, the Mexican like people love them, them yeah, like, everywhere. Yeah. They, the and I noticed how international they are because on TikTok, I saw, like, a bunch of people that are, that barely speak English posting that they're going. That's what I'm saying. Like, it's like, crazy. That's what I'm going to be. Obviously, Dominican Republic is like, the king. Puerto Rico is very similar in Cuba because we yeah. all like, like the same music. Okay. But let's not forget Argentina, Mexico, Paraguay. Like, all those countries, they love Aventura to the max, bro. Shout out to Romeo Santo. Yo, my man. I argue not, for not you. Romeo. Um, Aventura. Shout out to Aventura and Romeo Santo. Henry también. Anthony. Yeah. Shout out to Romeo Santo, bro. You know, nuevo. I argue crazy. That's a clip that got a million views, my, my dog. If you could get me in and shit, get yeah, me in there. Get us like some VIP passes. Um, Remember, every Friday, we live. YouTube live at 8.30 p.m. every Friday. This Friday, we going out right after the live. So we're going to be OD drunk. We're going to be pre-gaming at Chris House. Yeah, pre-game pre -game with S2D on Friday, you heard? On Friday, you heard? Um, Thank you for liking the video. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel right now. Please subscribe to the channel. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. That's all I'm going to say. And if you made it this far, um, thank you for always watching the video. This is Sorry to Disappoint. See you next episode, you heard?